Hey, I just uh, want to drop a note. I've seen a bunch of things here in the past couple of hours or so. Uh, I mean, I don't even know how to say it. I'll be, because whatever I say, I'll come off as judging somebody or or uh, being hypocritical or whatever. Let me, let me tell you something right off the bat. I'm probably one of the world's biggest hypocrites. And I say that, not that I choose to be hypocritical or choose to do something contrary to who I say I am, or who I claim to be. Here, oh, I guess, gosh, it's been 30 years ago, maybe, probably 30 years ago. I was attending a church, and uh, the church had me teaching Sunday school to kids who were, I don't know, probably eight, nine years old. I can't really remember the age group. I knew they were like, you know, younger kids, you know, but in, but in elementary school. I remember, you know, we're talking about the governing body of this church asked me and this other person to teach Sunday school. Wow, we thought, wow, man, we've, we've made it, man. We've, we have attained social status in the church. We've attained a place in the church to where now we're recognized for our skills. <laughs> Either we duped them or what? I don't know what the what what it is. In retrospect, looking back, man, hypocrite, 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 two-faced, lying, cheating dog. That's what I was. I uh, teach in Sunday school on Sunday morning. I'm, I'm 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 discipling young children on the ways of Jesus Christ. The weird thing about it is. The majority of the time, I was probably hung over from the night before going out and partying, drinking, carousing. But yet I was doing my penance the next morning, you know, oh God, you know, whatever. I say all of that to give credence to what I'm about to say because I have lived a lie in my life in the past so I have lived a way that was contrary to what I said I was you know to be at a church on Sunday morning and people believing that I'm all this and all that and they're entrusting they're entrusting their children with me wow I, I, don't, I don't even know I don't even know how to respond to that even as I'm thinking about it I don't even know how to even even go farther but being that I have grown since then, I'm, let, me, let me be honest with you. Uh, if, I, if I can be so bold as to be honest, and I, I pray that I am completely honest and open with you, no matter what. Dude, I was not saved. I don't care if I got baptized or if I said a prayer. I will guarantee you the fruit of what I was doing was contrary to what the gospel says. I was living a life contrary outside of the church building I was not a member of the church. I was not a member of the body of Christ. I was, I was uh, a hypocrite in the, in the greatest of terms. I mean, I'm doing, saying one thing on Sunday morning and proclaiming to be this thing, and I'm being entrusted with these children to teach them the ways of Jesus, and me, myself, are living contrary to what I'm teaching. That's a hypocrite. And I was huge. And I'm, I'm saying all this because I've got friends right now who claim to be believers i'm not you know we are you know i cannot judge the world jesus says the world is judged already i'm gonna tell you at the time when i was doing what i was doing if i had died i don't care if i was teaching sunday school seven days a week it did not make me saved it did not make me born again it did not have anything to do with anything other than the fact i don't even know why i was doing it to be honest with you uh so I say all that to give a little bit of credit to what I'm going to say, to give a little bit of backbone, a little bit of uh, uh, foundation of what I can say now. 
Now, I cannot judge the world. Jesus says the world is judged already. It's already condemned. It's already, it's, there's already something there. But, uh, and I, I'm going to have to pause this. I'll be back in a little bit. 